Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Captain Reese Fitzpatrick was a celebrated gunsmith who in the early 1820s made the original Bowie knife, following a pattern furnished him by Colonel James Bowie. A resident of Baton Rouge at the time, Captain Fitzpatrick subsequently centered his weapons business in Natchez and became the most notable sword maker in the Natchez district. Born in Cincinnati, Fitzpatrick most likely apprenticed under one of the many German knife makers there. In 1848, he was chosen to make a sword of honor for the citizens to present to General John Quitman for his service in the Mexican War. Later, Governor Pettus commissioned Fitzpatrick to make a presentation sword for Major Earl Van Dorn. Today, both of the swords are on display in the Old Capitol Museum. Fitzpatrick also fabricated a unique bayonet to attach to a rifle barrel, and during the Civil War, he outfitted a Natchez infantry company with Bowie bayonets, as they came to be called. Reputedly, when Jim Bowie's body was found at the Alamo in 1836, surrounded by Santa Ana's soldiers, he held Fitzpatrick's Bowie knife in his hand. Reese Fitzpatrick died in Natchez in 1868. My name is Bill Given, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.